Hello and welcome to 15 Minute Gamer. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button for more videos. And for as little as 99 pence, you can now join. Just click the join button above. Hey everyone, what's up? It is Tony here with an Aurora 4X video and we're on episode 4. It's been about a week since I've last played, so it's been a while. Um, I've been just playing loads of Escape from Tarkov. Uh, I love that game and I've had time to play it, so... Yeah, back to Aurora Forex. I've been missing this game. I've been missing on the development as well, so I'm looking forward to getting back into that. Um, so today's plan is we're going to look at creating a new engine. We're going to create a freighter uh, for cryogenic transport and moving equipment. Uh, looking at my notes, because it's been about a week, so you know we've got to look see what we're doing here. Uh, we're also going to move some um, auto miners to probably Venus, I would think. Um, and start getting the infrastructure over to Mars. And that should do us quite nicely for this video. We'll see how far we get. Um, as normal, we'll give it about half an hour. See what happens. Um, as you know, I never stick to 15 <laughs> minutes. This one, you won't get much achieved on this game 15 minutes. So let's see where we're up to. Um, Industry-wise, we were creating the automated mines and then fuel refineries. I'll tell you what, because I don't think we need fuel yet. I'm going to drop these down the queue a little bit. Um, can move them down to the bottom, in fact. Um, I want these infrastructure built quickly. Um, research, I'm going to modify you to 15. I think that'll be just better. So I'm going to modify you. Modify. I think 15 would be why are you not doing what I'm telling you to do? You. 15. Modify. Thank you. You're listening to me in the end. Um, I think that would be better. So let's see. Um, Mars is going to be our first place we want to check out. So I think, yeah, if we col set a colony up for there, that might be a good shout. To set a colony up, if you go into here, uh, up to here, click on Mars, and we're going to move this up a little bit, and we want to create a colony on Mars, and that's going to set that, it doesn't do anything, just telling you we're going to set a uh, colony up there. Um, Venus, I think that was the other one I wanted to have a look at. you have material wise that I might want a lot a hell of a lot of resources on there tell you what before anyone claims it because on my proper game where I'm running through someone did claim it um, so I think before anyone does that I'm also gonna um, take ownership of that and now as you can see we have stats for Mars and Venus as well there's obviously nothing on here yet but this means we can set up civilian contracts and stuff like that. So we will come back to all that in a minute. Now, first things first, new engine design. So we're going to click up here, up to the create project window. Want to create a new engine, uh, which is going to be much better than our old engine. So we're going to click on engines. It's going to be nuclear pulse engine at 80 engine power. We're going to drop it down to 50 because we want it to be a commercial engine. Uh, one size to be big because we need to be commercial and there we go commercial engine engine power of 100 fuel use isn't too bad actually it's actually pretty good so i think that looks good um who's gonna make them hooper engines limited stevenson wallace poor aero engines that looks good you're gonna be building them great yep and now we need to research it um when are you gonna finish that that's a while off that's a while off. So what I'm going to do is cancel that project. Madison, if you could do me a solid and um, research that engine, which is all the way down here. So you can have the five things, the five researchers. Um, after that, I want you to finish that off. I want you to work on, yeah, work on that because it's only 500 and then get our jump drive efficiency up and then work on a better engine. I think that, that could be good. That's a good thing for me, I think. 
Um, let's go out of research. It's probably not going to take long. Uh, 9th of July, a month and a bit. So if we go 30 days, uh, one 7th of July, it's going to be the 9th of July. It goes in five day ticks. Let's just go ahead, five days, and there we go. We've got our new engine. So let's get our freighter constructed. So we're going to go and design a new ship. Um, that's totally wrong, but it's totally it's been a while since I've played. I'm going to go there. Uh, new ship class. So this is the Manchester class. And this is going to be our freighter. So the Manchester class is our freighter. Freighter. There we go. Um, on this one, we're going to look at quite a few different things than we did last time. Um, we're going to do conscripts. Um, that is just means they don't... like. They don't need as much... I don't know how to describe them, but... It just basically means they're manned by people who kind of... We've concentrated them into it so they don't complain as much. They don't need as much things. That's kind of what it means. Um, yeah, I think we'll leave on that. Set deployment time. I always put deployment time. I'm going to put 12 months. It's never going to be that far away from home. It's going to just be ferrying really from Earth and to Mars and Venus. It's not going to go particularly far. Um... To transfer cargo, we need a cargo shuttle bay. So we need one of them. We need um, a... What else do we need on here? We need cargo hold. We're going to have a lodge. So lodge cargo hold can hold 125. We'll go to 250. I think that's actually... That's way too big. Let's get rid of one of your things. Um... Still seems a little bit high. I think a standard cargo hold is more than enough. Um, yeah, I think that's I think that's good. Now, when you put the cargo hold in, so it can carry twenty five thousand. Up here, it tells you how long it'll take to load infrastructure and drop the back off on the other end. See, five days up there. Want to bring that down a little bit? So what we can do up there is put some cargo shuttle bays in. So I want that right down. That'll do fine. I think that is more than fine. Um, cargo shuttle be good. We've got the load times down. Fuel, I think we'll bring up a little bit to 250. So we'll just put a nice little fuel storage in to 300. Yeah, I'm happy with the size tonnage so far. Um, and then I think what we need is some engines. Obviously, it would help. Uh, we have our new pulse engine engines so that goes 159 kilometers a second uh with one engine i think that'll be fine um it's classed as commercial so we don't have to worry about msp this time so that's good it's got a big range on there so i'm more than happy with that msp doesn't matter because it's cog it's commercial this time um it is currently 31,326 tons i'm happy with that I am happy with that. So, yeah, we're going to have that. Then what we're going to do is create a second one. Copy the exact same design, but instead of cargo space. Actually, how much does another cargo give you? Yeah, it's too much. I, that's way too much. I want to be 31,000 tons. It'll be fine. Um, we're going to copy design. So, we're going to come down here. And we're going to go to copy class. So, this is the Manchester copy. What I'm going to call this one, I'm just going to rename it. And I'm going to call it the Manchester um, Cryo. This is how we're going to move some colonists across to Mars. So, we want to get rid of... Um, actually, if we click wide view, just easier. Get rid of the cargo hold. And I want you to put cryogenic transport in. It's the only change I'm making. Let's put that in. You can see the speed difference because cryogenic transport isn't that bad. Uh, we want about 100,000 people, so let's get that up to there. 100,000. Perfect. Beautiful. Let's go out to engineering, and that's going to be fine. So we've got the Manchester class of ships. Um, what is handy if you copy something, though, what that means is the biggest one. So if we uh, retool our shipyard to fit this one, because the build cost is higher... It can also build 
the other one as well so we can build both ships which is quite good um and i'll show you that way in a second so what we're going to do is go to our shipyard click in here shipyards um it's a commercial and we've got forty thousand tons that's perfect so i want you to retool as the manchester cryo because that should mean we should be able to build the manchester as well so when you set activity and now you can build the manchester manchester cryo perfect so i want you to build a manchester first and we'll move it to the cargo fleet and um, this is just going to be called the manchester and we'll create task there Good. How long is that going to take? That's going to take till 20th of... Oh, not too long, actually. Not too long at all. Um, yeah, that sounds good. I'm just going through my notes to see what... Um, you know, I think we can pretty much just move around until this is done. I think that sounds good. Do we have any commercial ships up and running yet? We do. We have own ship and services so what i'm gonna do because i do want to colonize mars but we don't actually have any infrastructure built yet do we mm. oh we're building we're building how much do you have um 55 right okay so what i'm gonna do is set up a supply and demand and see if somebody else will do the work for me <laughs> so it's handy um so i want to mine venus and i want to send colonists to mars it's two things i kind of want to do on this one um, auto mines, we have 50 on Earth, and I want to move all of them to Venus. So what I'm going to do is go across to here to civilian economy. Earth is supplying. So I'm going to say that Earth has um, automated mine, and you have 50 at the moment. Okay, and I'm going to say Venus. Venus wants 50 of them. So I'm going to add demand and say 50 of them so basically what i'm saying there is venus wants 50 automated mines earth has 50 i'm hoping the civilian contractor will do that for me and they will then go and just go off and do it so let's see what happens when we go to 30 days we've got um i want to both our survey crafts out and about we've got one there Where's the other one i'm not too sure where the other one's Gone. Actually, you could be right out here. Yeah, you're all the way out there. Fine. Um, what's your logistics like? You've got plenty of fuel MSP, so you can stay out there. Let's go for another 30 days. Let's put auto turns on. Uh, we've got science team has begun. Yeah, Madison, good, 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 good. We'll go for another 30 days. We've got one inactive research facility on Earth because we've got a new one built. So I think we'll give that to construction rate. I want you. When's that? 2030. Um, yeah, let's give you another research. That's a 2050 July. I put it right down. Um, let's go for another 30 days. So they've started on the next one now. Madison is flying through. Absolutely flying through that research, which is good. And the research factories are coming on up as well. Um, we're not dangerous on any of these. No, I think we're fine. Has anyone shipped anything over to uh, Venus? We don't have any. No, no one's done that yet. And we haven't. Um, in infrastructure, we've got 200 infrastructure over here. I think I wanted more, actually. I think I need way more than that. Um, tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to build five terraformers to start terrifying, terraforming Earth, um, Mars eventually. And I want some more infrastructure because I think I've wanted more than that. Um, when I was making my little notes, no, I think I think that might be all right. But we'll want more, so I am going to queue up another hundred. And I'm going to move that up a queue right to the top. Um, and now that we've got some infrastructure on Earth, we have two hundred. I'm going to go to civilian economy again. I'm going to say you have infrastructure of 200 and mars wants 200 infrastructure we'll see if any of these civilians maybe fancy that job 
Uh, we've got the Manchester. Ah, the Manchester is built. Fantastic. So, cargo fleet. Manchester, I want you to detach you from where you are. I want you to have your own thing. And Manchester, what I want you to do is I want you to go from Earth. I want you to load installation. I want you to pick up some infrastructure. I then want you to go to Mars. I want you to unload everything. Oops. Mars. Unload infrastructure. I then want you to return to Earth and refuel. So I want you to do, and I want you to do that about, mm, let's see, so four, eight, 16 times. 16 times, I think we'll see how that's going after 16 times. So if we zoom in here, and if we go on to say eight hour chunk, there we go. He's off. He's off to Mars. How exciting is that? And there you go. He's at Mars and he's reloading. We have uh, one inactive, and what I'm going to do is give it to you. Actually, no, shall we start maybe something else? Um, I tell you what would be useful is let's get this terraform rate up. You have your first project, dude. Well done. Well done indeed. Um, let's go to 30 day chunks. So we've got another inactive one. I'm, again, I'm going to, because, you know, I like you. It's going to take a while for you to do, so I'm going to give you another re for the moment, another research lab for the moment. Um, what else happened? We don't have anything else exciting, so that's fine. The Manchester's flying to Earth and Mars. That's good. Science team has got, we've got another inactive. So what I'm going to do is get this one. Yeah, it's another two years away. Let's, let's get another one on you. I've got another one. I like when you start building. Uh, you can have another one. So, how many have we got left to build? Um, let's have a look. There are no 10. I think I... Ten, no, 10 should be fine. Should be good. Mars, how are you doing? Do you have infrastructure? You do. You have 100 infrastructure. Wow. It's moved across quick. So, we have room for workers on here now. So, we need to get people over here. And you know what I forgot to do? Build the ship for it. Um, so you, could you build me a, yep, Manchester Cryo, and I want you to create task. Sweet, let's continue on. Um, you done, you done, that's all right. I'm happy with that. Um, how's your mineral work going? Have you found anything useful? Not really. Hmm. Keep doing what you're doing. We've got another inactive. Ah, the Manchester's completed its orders. Good, good, good. Um, Next, what I want you to do then is I want you to start going to Venus. And over Venus, I want you to take something for me. Um, So I want you to go to Earth. I want you to load in station. I want you to pick up a mass driver. Just one. I want you to go to Venus. And I want you to unload the mass driver. And when you go back to Earth, I then want you to refuel. When you've done that, let me know. So I don't think that'll take long. I think maybe five days. Oh, we've got another inactive one. Um, who else could ground combat? Sensors. Now, that is an interesting one. I don't think we can start much in the way of sensors. So I want gravitational survey sensors. So I want you to start looking for them for me. Um... I want you to look at, yeah, I want you to start looking at that too. I've, I've selected you. Mm. Why won't you work? God damn it. Oh, yeah, of course, at the queue. Um, I want a CIC, but not yet. I want beam fire control, that's important. I want, um, that would be useful. That would be useful. Main engineering would be pretty useful. Um, and yeah, get that. I want that tracking done. And what I'm going to do, just to speed things up a little bit, I'm going to take away, because we don't need another engine for a little bit of time. So I'm going to just remove one from you and give it to you. Good. 
and you're gonna get all the rest now ah Manchester has completed all of those sweet so uh, Manchester you're back on the treaty again so I want you to go to yeah I want you to pick up automated mine and then I want you to go to Venus and I want you to unload automated mine and I want you to go back to earth and I want you to refuel and then I want you to do that until you're done good so now if I go to Venus, we should have a mass driver on here. Yes, we do. So to use the mass drivers, what we're going to do is go across to mining and we're going to select Earth. That means it'll throw all the stuff back to Earth. Um, we've got another Jev. London has discovered a mine on Zabilla. Good, uh, Lieutenant. And we've got one in active research and we want to get these going. So I'm going to give you another research lab. Sweet. Uh, we've got another one. Uh, we've got a. That's fine. I'm not fussed about that. So we need to give you another research thing. We're flying up on here. So I want to add. How many labs do we have now? 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 20. Hmm. I think maybe. No, six more should be alright because we do need to get looking at these other stuff. So yeah, I think we will start looking at them. Um. You start doing that. We've got another inactive research. You can have another one. And let's have a look. How long until you're ready? 2nd of May 2033. Still ages away. Wow. Let's give you who should we research rate. Would be handy. So let's find another one on you. Let's go another 30 days. We've got another one. Ooh. What's this? Gav London too, that's fine. Um, ooh, cause some of these taking ages. You can have another one as well. Let's get you going as well. FT Manchester is completed as well. So on Venus now, we've got 16 auto miners. Fantastic. I still think we have some left at Earth. We still have 34, yes. So we will get you to do them orders again. We need the rest there. Um, so Manchester, if you go to Earth, if you um, load installation and I want you to pick up some automated mines and when you go to Venus and I want you to unload the automated mines and then back to Earth and refuel and another couple of times sweet good 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 tenant that's fine we've got an inactive research facility um, and he's coming up to oh these two are gonna be really pretty similar to be fair Let's add another one to you. Let's get it done quick. I like the way these are coming in so quick. Um, let's add another one to there. 17th of January. It's almost done. In fact, that's going to be ready in five days. That's just five days. Good. They've moved on to their next thing now. Good, 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 good. Um, you've moved on to your next thing. Uh, fr three inactive. Wow. Okay. We didn't have a secondary thing. Uh, power and propulsion, is there anything else we want in here then? Gas cu cooled fast reactor. Um, let's start working on some of these. So I want you to create that project. Um, and then I want you to do that. 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 And that will do perfectly fine. And then finally, you've got that as well. Terraform bonus is increased, one in active research facility, and we'll give it to you. Looks good to me. Yeah, that's going to be ready pretty quickly, in fact. Ah, we've got the Manchester Cryo now. So, Manchester Cryo, you're going to take our first colonist to Mars. How exciting is that? So, I want you to come out the battle feet. So, detach out of there. And then I want you to go to Earth. I want you to load colonists and then I want you to go to Mars and I want you to unload colonists then back to Earth and refuel. You only have to do this one journey. You should be able to get as much on as I want. Um, let's repeat for maybe... Yeah, that'll do. That'll do. So let's fast forward just five days. That's all I want to do. Do we have some colonists on Mars yet? No, we still don't have anyone on Mars yet. Ah, there we go. Look at that. So we've got our first point three million people living on Earth. 
Um, so how much infrastructure we've got? We've got quite a lot of infrastructure over there. Um, as you can see, gravity and stuff isn't good enough on there yet. But we have the guys over here. And they'll start building stuff and doing stuff. We could actually maybe do getting some mines over there as well. Um, so what I'm going to do is... How's Earth doing on minerals? Oh, we are running a little bit low. I'm hoping they might build their own mines. But that's a dangerous thing to presume. So could you give me 100 mines I'm going to up the queue a little bit up the queue again and again and again you though I don't think we need you yet but I do want a backup and plus it's not actually going to take that much longer um, so we've got another inactive facility on earth um, is any of these we're not doing anything in defensive systems we haven't even started any on them um could you start looking at shield tech for me good and then when you've done shield tech i want you to look at new armor and um shield regeneration rate good 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 and let's go 30 days um they've started their new thing they've oh we've got ordnance factory and mines are starting to be produced down here good good and we're going to ship some of them mines off aha look at this we have a colony ship designed by CS Owens going to Mars at the moment. So they're dropping stuff off. So they've got a small colony ship at the moment. And they're taking stuff, air colonists to Mars for us. Fantastic. Um, science team, good. Let's go another 30 days. They're moving on to their next thing now. So how's Mars doing? Mars almost has a million people living on now. You know what? We haven't got a planetary governor. So let's see. Let's have a look. Um... We want admin. Let's see who's gonna be our Mars. Who wants who wants that job? We could do someone with quite a few good stats, mind. Um Terraform five percent. That's pretty cool. Does anyone have decent terraform? Um you have five percent. That's it. Five percent's the best. Hmm. What else do you have in production? I'm not too fussed about that. But the terraform thing would be nice. Um, Wealth Christian, 15%. No, that's pretty good. Yeah, you're going to Mars. Venus. Now, we need someone who's good at mining over there, because that's all we're using it for. You have 25%. Sorry, you're going off to Venus. Enjoy it. There we go. You're assigned to Venus. Let's go another 30 days. A um, lot going on here. I don't think anything too interesting though tell you what good time to check though how are our little ships doing oh these oh these need to come back jev london's been deployed for far too long um okay jev london could you come back i want you to finish what you're doing then come back to earth i want you to refuel and resupply jev london too i want to do the exact same thing when you're done i want you to come here and refuel and supply good because you've been out for far too long um we have another ship as well we have this we have two sh civilian ships down here now and the jev london jev london too are currently getting looked at so hopefully that should be them kind of done now um Where have they gone off to? I've told you to come back to Earth. Oh, it's because they've got standing orders, haven't they? Yeah, standing orders. No, no, no. Just come back to Earth. I just want you to get here. I want you to refuel and resupply um, after your next one. Just get back to Earth. Oh, we've got 12 inactive. Let's finish there. Um construction and production is up on here and what's going to be useful that would be useful so let's create that project on Zachary and then what I want you to do after you've done that one I want you to do that I want you to do Sorium 
and that that's your fourth thing you're going to be kept a little bit busy with uh jev london's completed all orders that means they should be nice right and all the automated mines have gone as well good so what's our place so mars has one million people um i think that's about it yeah i think do it they do want protection though they get this is something we're gonna have to talk about the next video um, apart from that though everything seems to be all right uh mining it's not doing any mining at the moment uh but we are working on that oh no we're overcrowding already on mars god damn it um how much infrastructure we got left on earth um 140 right okay we need to get that over there quite quick because otherwise these people are gonna start moaning um, I knew I kind of wanted a bit more than that. So, um, you, I need you to go to Earth. Um, can you just remove all? Thanks. Um, I want you to go to Earth. I want you to load installation. I want you to take some um, infrastructure. I want you to go to Mars. I want you to drop off the infrastructure and then come back to Earth, refuel and then repeat orders several times good i want to do that and we need because i always wondered about that um infrastructure i want you to build me another 300 and i want you to go up that queue oh and we need to actually cancel the demand for this so i want you to delete okay and venus delete demand from there earth i don't want you to send anything anywhere so i want you to delete and delete good that should stop their messages coming up oh good look at all them research complete on loads of things there and a civilian mining operations opened up on there okay what is over there then not too much on there not too much on there but what you can do here we can tax them or purchase we don't need anything off them so i'm gonna tax them um and they've got commanding officer and good everything else seems to be good so i think that's a good place to leave that episode we've got pretty much where i wanted to go um we've got mass drivers going on we've got everything down there we've got our freighter done so yeah i think i'm pretty happy with there um so i think we need a lot more infrastructure i have badly badly uh thingy dot so i'm gonna up that to another 600 infrastructure and i want you to pause and i want you to move you up um down queue you up queue and i want to get these built amazingly quick that should there we go start doing it good we need that done now right i'm gonna leave that there i hope you enjoyed the video um uh, we're gonna cover political stability in the next video and i'll see you guys next time goodbye